Alright, I just took off the trigger guard. And uh, yeah, the pills are on there. Hello. It's uh, actually on its way to get painted. See what we did? Is you, we, we're going to end up staining this and this. Even though the MG34 doesn't have a stain handle, I think it's going to look cooler anyways with the stain handle because black, I don't think would it would... It's got to have that... If, it, if it's already rounded, it won't look that great because... Metal's normally not rounded as much as that. Oh no. And uh, we finally attached these guys, and they were a little uh, loose. Loose. Well, what you do is you take electrical tape and wrap it around it, uh, the pole you're going to stick it on, and just kind of wedge it on there and take off. If you put too much on there, take it off, obviously, and you get it on there nice and snug. We just one rivet there. We riveted our little side piece. This guy was fun, little AA side part. Is what we did. I don't know where we found this piece either. It's uh, from a bike. Well, Something to do with like brake pad, I think. Ah, well, there you go. And we just kind of cut out the knock for it. And then we took a bolt and we drilled into there. Now, the tricky thing is, it's, I don't know if you can see in there, but we actually got mm -hmm. a nut to get in there. And we held it in there with uh, some screwdrivers and actually screwed it in there. That is <laughs> tricky. That reminds me of this business, doing this <laughs> stuff. But... It can be done. That's where pop rivets play a big role, but we didn't have a nice long pop rivet, so we'll do it the hard way. And uh, yeah, so uh, it's ready to get painted now. Cool. Okay. <clears throat> we started spray painting. I am the genius. I thought I was recording, but uh, I guess not. So you missed all of our funny little comments like, Surgeons, put your mask on. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, we're uh, wearing masks. Just because, uh, you know, we don't really feel like blowing out our noses full of black black, black crap that you uh, inhale. That you inhale, yeah, that's not very fun. No, uh, we he was using a, uh, is it a flat black or gloss black? Uh, this is a uh, color place gloss black from uh, Walmart, which is probably the better place to go get your spray paint. 99 cents, it's cheaper. 99 cents. But yeah, as you can see, all the green and whites and yellows and all that crazy mess, it's all been it's all been blacked up now. And he'll eventually add some gray onto it and make it more authentic. Metal. Right now it just looks like, you know. Whoa. Uh -oh. Could be. Maybe. But yeah, like like we were saying before I started recording. Um that you want to take your time on this you know if you can't get to something just wait till it dries and flip it over and you oh don't gosh. want it to uh, glob up because it'll look like a third graders art project that's why Pearson doesn't spray that's paint. why I don't spray paint because mine will just uh, it's bad looks like Trent Stewart sweating <laughs> he's a he's a drummer for blind intentions and that kid sweats I mean it's like it's like beads like his pores is like triple in size and you just start letting out water. But yeah, we uh it's starting to look pretty sweet. The little thing that he's using to spray is a little a little gun looking thing. You can get those for a couple bucks at Walmart. We just happen to find them going through a box of old stuff. You just uh just clip it onto your deal. And uh there One it goes. important thing though, yeah. We're taking the gun off. Don't go forward to spray it. Go back, so that way the little nozzle thing that you click down on that sprays it doesn't spray you. <laughs> <laughs> you done it before? No. Oh. I actually uh, used my brain once. Wow. I know, it was crazy. That's ridiculous, I, I didn't dude. Even mess up. It was. That's ridiculous. All right, now he's gonna hit it off with some. Uh... Now you still have some under stuff that you can't get to right now, but you'll hammer them later. Actually. It's kind of weird not smelling spray paint, you know? Oh, I smell it. I barely do. Mine's just not as bad anymore. Taking all the fun out. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, don't try to get high with that. Uh, it kills brain cells. 
all the interesting stuff that we see. Yeah, everything, everything becomes like 20 times funnier, you know? <laughs> I mean, I could have sworn Hitler was standing in here one time, you know? I was just like, whoa. <laughs> what the? Uh, wait, what? Wrong place, chum. Dude, you're supposed to be dead. <laughs> I don't know if you can really get that inside barrel, but no matter what, if you at least gloss it a little oh, bit. Oh, it's... I think it looks fun. Yeah, you, may, you may hit it with some of the gray on the way back. Hmm. Now, see, if this were me, I, I would wait till it dries to put the gray on, but... Neil likes to do them at the same time. That like blends better or something, I'm not even sure. What's your reasoning behind that? Sure, it blends better, yeah. Look, I just gave him his reasoning. Way to go, me. Well, I mean... You can wait till it dries, you can do it... I like to do it personally. I think I'd rather wait till it gets a little bit dry. Because otherwise it doesn't really stick. This just gives me a reason to coat more black. Alright, well, we're going to pick this up when he's done with all of it, and we'll show you it with when the tape is taken off.